Hello, welcome to Afro News South Africa. Please kindly subscribe and share. Turn the notification on so you would be notified each time we upload a new video. Supporters of former President Jacob Zuma will take protesters from KwaZulu Natal to Johannesburg for the rally that aims to get President Cyril Ramaphosa kicked out of office. The protests will happen on Friday in front of Luthuli House, which is where the ANC is based. The people who support Zuma say that there are plans to get the protesters from Durban to Johannesburg. Since the 2017 National Conference of the ANC, when Ramaphosa was chosen as president, he has been in a power struggle with Zuma supporters. Former spy boss Arthur Frazier told the police that the president hid a robbery that happened at the president's Falla Falla farm in 2020. Even though thieves got away with a lot of money in US dollars, Frazier told the police in an affidavit that Ramaphosa tried to keep the robbery a secret by not charging the thieves with the crime. The sub judas rule is why Ramaphosa won't answer questions about the robbery. Nkasen Shishizi, who is in charge of Radical Economic Transformation RET, and is a strong supporter of Zuma, said, Our message is very simple. Ramaphosa should step down. Last month, Shizi and other Zuma supporters filed gender-based violence charges against Ramaphosa after hearing that a domestic worker who helped the Fala Fala farm robbers was tortured by police connected to Ramaphosa's presidential protection. You knew the protest against Ramaphosa will put even more pressure on the president, who is already facing anger from the public over the country's power outages, rising fuel prices, and worsening poverty and unemployment. Ramaphosa is having trouble just a few months before the ANC's national elective conference in December, where he is likely to run for a second term as party president. Even though he still has support in the ANC, there have been rumors that the RET, opposition parties, and civil society could put pressure on Ramaphosa to step down. Mavuso Simeng, a veteran of the ANC's fight for freedom, has asked Ramaphosa to think about stepping down because of the Palapala Pala farm scandal. I think it would have been best for the party's leaders to tell him to step aside until his problem is solved and let someone else run the party in his place. Again, resistance organizations, including the EFF, have asked the president to step aside pending an investigation into allegations of the capture and payoff of suspects, following the burglary of a significant amount of foreign currency at his game ranch in Lampopo. But according to David Malobo, head of the ANC's Peace and Stability Committee, President Cyril Ramaphosa won't back down due to the embarrassment. Malobo claims that while the case is being investigated, the president is not subject to any traditional sanctions. Malobo claims that people acting too quickly and advising the president to retreat because of his current situation need to be corrected. Malobo agrees that everyone in the ANC must go by the same norms, and he will assist. Is this even possible at all or how do we even react to this development? Could this be a good news for us? Please drop your thought on this news. Thank you.